Hi, I'm Peter Knett here with Daily Extra, and I'm here with the filmmakers behind What Is Left, um, Gustav Hoffer and Luca Ragazzi. Very well done. Okay. Well done. <laughs> So maybe to start things off, you guys could just tell us a little bit about the film and what you guys are trying to do. Well, what is left, uh, you know, plays with the double meaning. What is left, what is left wing, but also what is left of the left. So we always try to make personal stories um, which matter to us. And in that case, we were about to go to the elections. We had this big, big hope that finally we, Italy, after years of Berlusconi, would finally have a progressive government that would be like very pro-gay rights and you know all this stuff. And then. Unfortunately, it didn't happen, and so we wanted to investigate about this question, which uh, we think it's uh, it's a universal question because when we talk to our, fr our friends in Germany or in France, they say, you know, what does it mean to be left wing today, and why, in a moment of crisis, um, the left wing parties don't win; they lose the elections. So we started to we tried to make a funny film about Italian politics, looking from the left senso di responsabilità. Cioè sono stanco del senso di responsabilità. Non abbiamo vinto anche se siamo arrivati i primi. I mean, you guys have had a long-standing personal and professional relationship. How does that how does that work working together, <laughs> living together, all of that sort of what's the progression of that relationship been like between the films? We're getting older together and uh, we we have a lot of fun. We don't do any close-up <laughs> shots anymore. <laughs> no, we 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 like this creative process uh, of uh, making a film and uh, the most funny moment is probably the editing. The editing is well, very creative. It funny. It's funny but with lots of discussions but I think it helps. I mean I, I can't imagine to suggest uh, this uh, way to others couples. I can say it works for us but I don't know if it's a good way for others. I don't know. Sometimes people think it's too bad to mix up uh, private and uh, work. We do because we mix up everything, clothes, friends, food, uh, bed, whatever. So mm, we, we, we do work together. Cosa significa oggi essere di sinistra? Fare i bravi casalinghi organici alle donne. Finché ci sarà una disuguaglianza ci sarà bisogno della sinistra, quindi questo significa essere di sinistra. Il tema del, dei migranti, i temi legati alle donne, la violenza, il carcere, se non se ne occupa la sinistra. One thing I found really interesting while I was watching the film, um, the question of what is left, uh, I've always sort of thought about that in terms of um, same-sex marriage. Is that really a, a sort of left-wing idea or is it actually kind of a conservative idea? And just maybe you guys could talk a little bit about the situation um, facing same-sex marriage in Italy now. Well, it's really interesting what you're saying because for us uh, it always was a left-wing idea, you know, same-sex rights, uh, it's something which the conservatives uh, wouldn't stand for, but if you look at what happened in the UK where a conservative government introduced gay marriage, you would say, saying that marriage is a conservative idea, then you would say, oh, uh, well, maybe <laughs> they are right and we shouldn't fight for equality, but I mean, we still do, and we are convinced that equal rights uh, is not, not, nothing left or right, it's, uh, you know, basic standards. and. Um, um, and it's, you know, the, the gay right issue is always an issue uh, which identifies, which gives a direction to, to a policy, at least that's what my impression is. But for in Italy, for example, even though uh, it's a left-wing government, they are not able to say, okay, we are pro-gay marriage or uh, for adoption uh, for gay couples as well. So um, in Italy, basically, over the past uh, six years since we made our first film, nothing has really changed. So in the first film we tell the story of uh, us as a couple not getting uh, uh, something like a civil partnership uh, in Italy. Since then nothing has changed. We have a new pope, we have a new government, but we still have no gay rights. Uh, finally, I'm just curious like, what's next for you guys and sort of what your progression as um, filmmakers is going to be from here. We consider those three movies we made uh, like an Italian trilogy. So we, we want to turn page now and uh, I, I can't say what, what's next, but I can, say that, I can say that maybe it will be something more about Europe and not just Italy. We are a little bit sick of our country. It's <laughs> going to be boring because nothing really changes. So maybe now we want to watch uh, 
outside and uh, to tell a story about Europe, which is becoming more and more interesting in this moment. So thanks so much for being here with us and Thank enjoy you. the rest of your time in Toronto. Thank we you. Will, we will.